everyone. Welcome back. Is this not love weekend and love week, right? <laughs> if no one ever told you that they love you, listen, God loves you and you don't have to even question it because he does. <laughs> so welcome to the journey of vision. My name is Rosalind Streeter and on this journey, you will soon learn it's just so much easier with God. All right, guys, come on, let's chat. Okay, guys, so I am back again. I am on what? Part three of God said, no matter what it looks like, follow my instructions. Listen, part one and two is getting really good. So we're going to jump right in. Part three, here we go. God said, I see you and know what you are going through, what you are enduring. No, it's not fun. Trust me, I know. But count it all joy when you go through these various trials. Count it all joy when your father trusts you enough to put you up against a test. Mm. He said, knowing the suffering, he said he trusts you even though he knew that you would suffer. My God. He said, and knowing the outcome, he said he trusts you because he knows you're going to complete this test. Why me, you ask? God, God, I can hear people saying, why me, Father? Why do I have to go through this suffering? Why do I have to endure? Time after time, why do you keep testing me? Mm. Then God said, why not you? Mm. He said, why Job? What did he do to me but love me? Come on, y'all, read that. You gotta read the story about Job and how he served the father. But my guy, he came up against the test, did he not? A great test. And I'll put the scripture up. So why Job? What did he do to me but love me? Worship me, serve me with his heart. His whole heart. Yes, Lord. Then God said, why not Job? Mm. He said, I have no respect. I, I do what wills the Father. It's for my glory. Mm. There, that go there it goes again. It helps us understand why are we here on earth? What are, what are we doing, right? God said it's for his glory. The reason why you're here, the reason why you're chosen, the reason why I sought you out is because of my glory. He said it's for my kingdom. Then he said, oh, I love this part, y'all. He said it may not make any sense now, but it will. Why do, why do I love this part, y'all? I love it because God has opened up a door, right? So he's saying, yes, you're being tested. You're coming up against a lot. And he's talking about right now. Some of you guys are watching me with tears in your eyes once again. Some of you guys are watching me. You just got up off the floor praying and seeking God's face. Some of you guys are watching me. You just lost your job. My God. Some of you guys are watching me. You just lost someone in your family. My God. And you're like, why me, Lord? Because your heart is heavy and it's hurting. And God is like, why not you? Why Job? He said, yes, he understands. It's not fun. He said, trust me, I get it. But it's for my glory. And it's for my kingdom. That's why I want y'all to study Job, okay? Which I'll put the scripture up again. And he said, it may not make any sense now. And the door that is open, it says, but it will. Which means God is going to bring understanding through that door, right? 
So maybe right now you don't understand, but let's just say months from now, the understanding come and it lessens the weight that you carry. So you can keep going, so you can keep moving and striving for his glory, for his kingdom. Rosalind, why are you here? Why are you doing what you do for his glory, for his kingdom? That's the only reason why. I have no motives here. Please understand me. God said, get on YouTube. So I did it. And if he said, get off YouTube, I will do it. It's for his glory, y'all. That's why I'm here. And like God said, why not you, Rosalind? Filling your name, you guys, why not you? Hmm. So you guys, I want you to really think on that. Study Job, understand who he was and what he had to endure just because he loved the father the way he did. Mm. No other reason, y'all. <laughs> because he was faithful and he loved the father the way he did. And God said with his whole heart, not partially, but with his whole heart, he loved him no matter what. No matter what he faced, he still loved his father. Hmm, that is good, y'all. That is good. All right. So again, think on part three and part four coming right up. And of course, you already know, especially with Love Week, y'all. We love you. Bye.